Uh, and now, have you guys ever done this before where you put, where you are just button mashing through this whole healing process and then you start it back up again? Oh, yeah. And I gotta make sure to talk to everyone when we get to certain towns because what I keep forgetting to do anytime I've ever gone to a new town is I need to talk to people because some people will give me things. <laughs> and, um, <laughs> yeah, that's really good. Oh, doof doof. Ah, oh, man, I'm, I'm, I'm actually kind of glad that my first Pokemon I had to catch is not a Bidoof. Oh, don't get me wrong. I love Bidoof, but I, I just, I just can't. I just... All right. So he doesn't have good physical attack, but he'll have great special attack. So we'll have to make Luffy a special attacker, which is kind of ironic at the same time. Because <laughs> Luffy's a physical attacker. But that's okay. Oh, okay. I might have to... Yeah. <laughs> I might speed through some of this stuff. Because it's not exactly important, but, you know, you know how it goes. But it is good to fight Starlies because Starlies give, um, speed EVs. So, um, I want my, uh, I want Luffy to be really fast. Ah oh, man. So I guess what we could talk about is, um, the reception to this game. I will not, I will not deny, a lot of people were very mad about how this game, how this game looked. And to be frankly honest, I can't blame them. It doesn't look fantastic. It, 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 it looks, it looks playable. It obviously looks nice, but with all the stuff that we've seen in the past, oh, we're in Lake Verity Front, so, um, hmm, do I want to catch something here yet? Maybe not. Maybe. Ah, what the heck. Let's, uh, let's look for something and see if we get the three strikes rule. Um, I... Alright, that's strike one, so we do not have to catch this one. But I only got three more opportunities <laughs> after, after this. So if it is something we've already caught, then we'll have to, we'll have to, um, catch it. <laughs> And obviously, I'm going to try and catch it because I'm not going to waste a perfectly good, um, a good catch. But, um, yeah. People were not happy with how this game was. But at the same time, I'm just like, I don't really... The only thing that I can understand is, is the graphics. It's, it's... For starters, it's playable. It works. It, it obviously works. It obviously functions. But yes, it's so jarring how how the people at, uh, at Game Freak thought that this chibi style was okay. Hey! We haven't caught a, 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 a Bidoof, so it's time to catch ourselves a Bidoof. <laughs> Alright, a female Bidoof. I seem to be getting a lot of females on my team. <laughs> Alright, that should do it. Okay. Alright, Bidoof, you're mine. So I did this little I did this little ritual when I was a kid and I played Pokemon. I would um I would I would count to three on my fingers. One, two, three, and then I would snap my finger at the time that I that usually that you would hear the click you would hear the clicking noise. I, I don't know. It was just a it was just a ritual that I had. Alright, female do Bidoof. Hmm. Um Hmm. Ah, you know what? I'm not, I'm not very, uh... <laughs> you know what? Let's give this Bidoof a nice name. Let's call her Constance. <laughs> if I spelled that wrong, I'm sorry. <laughs> Welcome to the team, Constance. <laughs> okay, cool. So we've co collected our Le Verity Lakefront, um, Pokemon. We've already got our two, uh, our Route 201 Pokemon. So let's go head back to our mother and tell them that we're going on our grand, grandiose journey. Because, oh boy, a journey it is going to be. 
Yep, yep, that's right. My The professor guy doesn't want to do the work, so I'm going to do it myself. <laughs> ah. Yes, I'm, I'm useful information, adventure. You can check in your bags, key items, pocket. Cool. Oh, Keith's mom. Oh, yes, we got to get the, uh, the parcel over to him. Because he's so forgetful, because he runs all over the place. And we're heading to Jubilife City. Now, oh, right. Can't forget the hat and the scarf. I look like a tool. <laughs> All right, thanks, Mommy. All right, the time has come. With Luffy, Kazooie, and Constance on my side, we shall take on every challenge that lies ahead. Starting with this foul Starly right here. Give me a second. <laughs> I can already tell the comments are going to be like, Oh my goodness, he's doing everything wrong. <laughs> oh boy. I already, I, I, I already have this like, this premonition feeling that things are going to go awry. <laughs> Especially with the first gym leader being a rock type gym leader, and I have the fire starter. But again, everybody chose Charmander in Gen 1, and Rock was a rock type gym leader, the first one. So, what's so different here? <laughs> now, I do have a trick that will help. <laughs> The only issue is, is that it might not work well, given the fact that he's not much of a physical fighter. <laughs> But we're gonna do it anyways, because we're crazy. <laughs> Alright, Kazooie's level 5. And she learned Quick Attack. Very nice. Can you learn Breagle Bash or something? Like that ground pound move? You know, if if if, if Badoof was a uh, if Badoof was a boy, I would have nicknamed him Banjo. <laughs> Is there anything over here? Okay, this is Route 219. There's something right here. An antidote. Very nice. But I will say one thing. The water physics, like I said, um, the water physics look great in this game. <laughs> there clearly was effort put into it. It just... I, I feel we, we all agree that they could have put more effort into it because Pokemon is one of the greatest grossing franchises. They, they have the money, they can do it, they just choose not to. And I think that is what drives Pokemon fans nuts. So I can totally understand it, but at the same time, I, I actually love this game. When, when we knew it was coming out, I bought uh, Diamond for myself and uh, Pearl for my brother, and we played together for a long time before he had to move up to... Uh, Move uh, uh, away from uh, from where I from where I am. Uh, move to Michigan, yeah. But um, but yeah, it's I, I and I think it's the nostalgia factor. I am confident that it's the nostalgia factor. And can I? Uh, I will say one thing. That I complain. We do not need a catching tutorial on how to catch Pokemon. Yes, I know Pokemon is a kid thing, but kids are smarter than this. They know how this goes. I think. Maybe someone's going to get really offended that I dare assume that everybody knows this. Just do your thing. Do your thing, honey. All right, you caught a Bidoof. Congratulations. You get a cookie. No, you don't. <laughs> yes, yes. I'm fully aware of how that works. And she also gives me some Pokeballs. So I've got plenty of Pokeballs to spare. All right, we're on Route 202, so the three-strike rule will recommence. <laughs> so if I find a Pokemon that I um, already caught, then we will just defeat it and move on to the next one. So this is Strike 1. That's Strike 2. Oh, nice shot. Critical hit. I think we're gonna move a, a, a little forward into Route 202 and fight some trainers for the first time. 
Unless, of course, we hit strike three before we even make it over there. Okay. So let's do some trainer fights, and then we'll look for strike potential strike three or potential first catch of 202. Yeah. I hope people don't get too offended by my three strike rule. I only do it for the sake of variety. I don't want to have all the same Pokemon in my first group. Uh, in my first group, uh, group of six. <laughs> I, I, I'm, I'm sure that makes sense. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, fighting... Ooh, quick attack. Smart. <laughs> Alright. Down you go. Funny enough, um... Luffy can actually combat against his rival starter because of his fighting type. <laughs> Yes, I'm too strong for you, buddy. <laughs> All right, let's see. Let's deal with this lass over here. Yes, you spy a little trainer. I'm gonna, I'm gonna thrash ya. Now the battle, the battles, uh, um, scenes look good. I mean, they put a lot of effort into these. I think for me, and this is just me personally, as long as the core formula. The whole the battle system, um, um, like works and functions and looks good. Everything out outside of it really doesn't matter that much to me because again, Pokemon is all about the battle. So it's all about fighting. <laughs> it's always been that way, and for what I'm looking at, it looks really nice. <laughs> All right, Constance is level five, and she learns Defense Curl. Very good, Constance. Another Badoof. Bring it on. I feel like I'm going to regret um, um, <laughs> having it uh, ha having it on set because I feel like that is going to probably be my downfall. Oh boy, I. I uh, I'm already sort of regretting this. <laughs> All right, Natalie, you're done. And the animations on the trainers is done really well, too. But again, only in the battles. Everything else is just so Funko Pop-ish. <laughs> oh, dear. This is strike three. So after this Pokemon, I have to catch whatever appears next. So no matter what it is, we have to catch it. <laughs> But I guess we're getting some good um, HP EVs from, from the doofs. Which might be the reason why we find so many of these in the, uh, in, in, in the start of the game. Alright, so whatever Pokemon comes next, we have to catch it. And the winner is... Another Starling. Okay, alright, I guess we can use another one of you guys. Maybe. <laughs> All right, this one is also female. Which is a shame. I was really hoping to get a Shinx, but I guess, uh... All right. Yay, I've got two birds now. Whoop de doo. <laughs> All right, Luffy learned taunt. That's a very Luffy thing to do. Give Starling a nickname. Yes. Ah. Uh... Ah. Uh, okay, Kazooie. Is there another female bird in in, in Banjo Kazooie that I'm not aware of? <laughs> What's the name of that that chicken? Ah, you know what? I'm just gonna call her Janet. <laughs> I don't know. Doesn't sound like a bird name, but welcome to the team, Janet. You're probably gonna be replaced by somebody else. <laughs> All right, let's see how we're doing. Okay, we need to um, probably go back and heal really quickly. So there'll probably be some cutting here and there. But uh, yeah, I was hoping to catch a Shinx. I was really crossing my fingers. I was hoping to catch a Shinx. But, uh, nope. I'm probably gonna put... You know what I'm gonna do? I'm probably gonna put Janet back in the, uh, in, in the PC. Might as well get this taken care of now. 
Alright, someone PC. Yep. Alright. Janet, you're going in here. And then box number 18. Let's change the wallpaper. And uh, I already decided on one that works. This one right here. And then change its name. And this is the graveyard. This is where all the Pokemon that faint on our journey that are on our team go to. Because I, I can't in a good conscience release them. But at least there is an area that is... That is guarded by Giratina, of all things. Whew! Oh, boy. <laughs> okay. All right, let the adventure recommence. Now, I will say Collision is a little finicky in this game, too. Like, I find my character always bumping into things when I'm trying to go around corners and stuff. And I think it's because the game doesn't, doesn't, um... Re realize that, oh yeah, your character no longer has to stick to the grid pattern. They can actually walk diagonally, but everybody else is limited to the grid pattern. It's so, oh, it's so distracting. It's so distracting, I tell ya. Okay. We're still just fighting things and all that fun stuff. I bet a Shinx is gonna appear. Now, why did it show that? Why did it show my character first before this, before showing Starling? I have no idea why it sometimes does that. If someone knows, let me know in the comments below, because I do not know why. Okay, good. Well, it might be good that he's a special attacker, because everyone keeps on using Growl. Alright, there we go. Kazooie's level 7. So far, so good, though. You gotta keep in mind that the first gym leader's uh, strongest Pokemon is level 14. So we have to keep that in mind. <laughs> Alright, Buckaroo. What do you got for me? Oh, you have a Shanks. That's nice. <laughs> Would've been nice if one of those appeared, but... Thanks. I guess we're gonna have to find another, uh, another <laughs> electric type. <laughs> Who knows when that's gonna be. Or a grass type. We could you probably use a grass type. What are you looking at me like that for? <laughs> Alright, there we go. Good attack, Eevee, right there. You're like, wow. Well, of course I'm like, wow. Alright, I'll go over here. There's a potion. We'll take that. Oh, the trees look the same. It's hilarious. And we're now in Jubilife City. And now she's going to critique how I don't have that many Pokemon. Yes, I know I'd feel a lot safer. Well, unfortunately... <laughs> This is where this is where I am. Now we need to go to the trainer school. Talk to Barry. Alright, thanks for the parcel. I'm gonna get a town map. Which will be really nice. Okay, now I can fight these two characters right here. Now, there's 204 that way, and 203 this way, and 218 that way. I know we can actually hit 204 and catch a Pokemon there before we head over to Orberg City, but we're going to have to fight our rival first. So, I am... Hold on. Before I fight them, I'm going to heal up. Yes, they, they, they both have an Abra on their team. So I think we should be fine. Maybe. Hopefully. <laughs> I, uh... I have, uh... I have misgivings. Just a little bit. I mean, uh, imagine. Imagine for a split second. Imagine for a split second that I lost my starter to a little kid. I would be... I'd be so embarrassed. I'd be so embarrassed. I might not even post this video if, th if that happened. 
Okay, you little rugrats, let's do this thing. All right, Luffy, show them what you got. Okay. Ooh, level six, level nine. Faster, that's good. Critical hit, very nice. Charge beam. Ouch. Alright, do one more ember, that should do the trick. And you're a special attack uh, EV, so that'll be good for a free EV. Alright, Constance is level 6. Alright, cool. Cool, 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 cool. All right, now let's uh, make sure. Yeah, I think you can. I think you'll last. Famous last words. Actually, I'm really curious. Trainer card. Oh, that work. That actually works because our last number was four, so that would have been the fire type, anyways. So I feel a little bit better about that. So... All right, now she's got an Abra as well. All right, Luffy, do your thing. Good. All right, charge beam. Please don't paralyze me. trying to use synchronize on me. Interesting. <laughs> the burn took it out. That's really cool. Alright, Luffy's level 10. And Kazooie's level 8. If, Luffy, if Kazooie learns wing attack soon, that'd be really nice. That'll help us in the, in the future. Yeah. Alright. Really glad that I didn't die to those kids. So I'm gonna go talk around, and then we're gonna go hit two. We're gonna hit Route 204 and catch a Pokemon there. I have high hopes that we're gonna catch a Grass type Pokemon. Oh wait, hold on a second. I gotta do this for this guy. Oh my goodness, that's so distracting. It's like everybody's a robot on a conveyor belt. Okay, yeah, I gotta go talk to all those clowns, but you're not gonna see that. I'm gonna. I'm going to do all that stuff and then get the poke edge. So, uh, see you back in the morning.